Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, I'm Bill. We're going to be in Basic Fantasy 3rd uh, Edition. We're going to cover the rule Evasion and Pursuit. You can get your own copy of Basic Fantasy at basicfantasy.org. They're free, uh, at least all their PDFs are. The books you do have to pay for because they do have to get printed. So, Evasion and Pursuit. Sometimes a party of adventurers will want nothing more than to avoid a group of monsters or sometimes it's the monsters avoiding the adventurers. If one group is surprised and the other is not, the unsurprised group may be able to escape automatically, unless something prevents them from making an exit. Otherwise, the characters wanting to flee begin doing so on their initiative numbers. The GM may easily play out the pursuit, following along on his or her map. Note that the players can't draw maps while they are running headlong through the dungeon or wilderness area. Any time a character must pass through a doorway, make a hard turn, etc., the GM may require a saving throw versus death ray, with dexterity bonus added in. If the save is failed, the character has fallen at that point and moves no further that round. He or she may stand up and make a full move on his or her initiative number in the next round. If at any point the pursuers are within 5 feet melee range, at the start of a round, they may begin melee combat. The fleeing characters will be subjected to parting shots, as described under defensive movement, if they continue to flee after the pursuer is close to melee range. If the fleeing character or creatures are even able to get beyond the pursuer's sight for a full turn, they have ended pursuit. The pursuers have lost them. So that, that's an interesting way that they handle um, fleeing characters and pursuing a fleeing character. Um, it just, it starts to remind me of chase rules from uh, uh, Call of Cthulhu 7th edition. Those are really good rules. Um, you should look into them. I'd recommend to anyone that wants to run an actual chase. And it is compatible with D&D rules as far as movements go. So, I did a video on that in the Call of Cthulhu playlist, so check that one out too. Let me know what you thought about evasion and pursuit rules in the comments below. Until we all game again, guys.